from the Las Vegas Hilton, this is Penthouse Vegas. You know, I think it's quite safe to meet an ex-girlfriend at your own party. But many, many years ago, I took the next friend of mine shopping to a funny store in Los Angeles called Trashy Lingerie. And she's made a career out of that shopping day. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it's a very beautiful <laughs> Ronda Sheer. Robin, mm, I did. But it's true, right? Absolutely. You put me in lingerie, a Trashy Lingerie, and I've not been able to get out of my knickers since then. Eight years that's on... That's an English word for yes, panties. Yes, that's what it is. I'm up all night where I hosted a show from the bed. I <laughs> can't get out of bed. You it's great. Very it's so funny because you went from our date at Trashy Lingerie right. into the bed and yes. you were on up all night on USA for how long? Eight years. Eight years. In my lingerie. And so it's been great. I mean, you know what? Because I learned so much about lingerie, but you were the one who taught me. <laughs> and then you started a show called Rhonda's Pajama Party. Rhonda Shear's Comedy Pajama Party. So it's me and four other ladies in their PJs on stage telling jokes. Because there's something very funny about being sexy and funny. I you agree. would know that. <laughs> Because, as I say, behind every great woman is a great behind. <laughs> <laughs> no, so, and so it's, it's, it even gets better. But you, the truth of the matter is lingerie is something that, that women love, all shapes and sizes, and I've known that for years. And so what I did was I started creating my own lingerie line. I had nowhere to go with it. I couldn't find Robin. I, I, you weren't there to help me. So I went to Home Shopping Network, and I brought a line of lingerie to them that shapes women called Sheer Shapewear. So I'm shaping America, one at a time. I'm beautifying America, and I'm really excited about it. Because, you know, you guys never dress up. You buy, what, one three-pack of jockeys, and it lasts your lifetime. Not this Women, guy. Not you. Not this guy. <laughs> I go to France for mine. Oh, there you go. Well, you're the only one. Because no, most guys, you know, so. they get holes in their underwear, and they're going, wow, they're finally broken in. No. <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> it's true. But women, on the other hand, love their undies. Oh. Uh, and thank goodness. Yes. And so true. you're teaching America to dress I up to undress. I am. I am. I am. And it's I'm funny, isn't it? You have to dress them up to do. undress. Because absolutely, because it's the foundation is where fashion starts. It's what's going on you underneath. Little corporate woman, uh, yes. you. <laughs> I know, but it's great, and it's it's sexy, and um, as I say, you have to slip into slim. But I've got some great stuff, and my and my lingerie comes. I start small, and I go all the way up to all. 48 double D. I've got something for everybody, and I've got something for That's you That's modern America, right? 48 yes, double D. Yes, it is. Yes, <laughs> double it is. dynamite. Well, you know, some, it's, it's hard to find those sizes. I'm saying this like he would know this. <laughs> but I do. But you do know this. It's hard <laughs> to find you, the little you've sizes. Arranged, you've arranged for some ladies to I come to our party tonight dressed in your clothing. Yes, I do, because I knew that you would like that kind of bringing back our past and what you did to me many years ago, how you started my career. So here they come. Here's two of my all right, lovely so why don't you gals. tell all of our friends at home look at them aren't they fabulous these two gorgeous models this is my plum rose collection of sheer shapewear this will be on home shopping network they're beautiful aren't that great and see it's they're actually full bottoms so there's no thong no uncomfortable thong look they they fill it out just perfectly hello and uh, it's comfortable right ladies Yes. See? Because my, my ambition in life is to see how far lycra can stretch. So I've put a little bit of lycra into all of my bras and panties. Right. So, so it's I want you fast. two ladies to stretch out on the bed and we'll meet yeah. the next two ladies. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. come and on. And then everybody winds up <laughs> and on the bed. Know, they somehow model it better than it looks on the hanger. It absolutely looks great. Okay. Okay, so okay, what's see, next? This is my convertible bra and little boy shorts. And uh, this bra, isn't that fabulous? Look, it's a five-way bra. It can be worn as a halter, um, as uh, strapless. See, it's clear straps. I don't know if you can see that. And, and then she's wearing my fabulous loungewear. You can either wear that out, or you can wear it to bed, or you can use your imagination, Robin. Or you bring it to the Penthouse Vegas can, party. Absolutely. All right, ladies, come sit on the bed. Isn't Join that us. pretty? It's a great lace, and they're doing a fabulous job. And then we have a... Uh, the, our, our white virginal outfit for you, just for you. This is my bustier. It's actually a great selling bridal bustier. She looks great in this. This is what young brides wear when they, <laughs> when they get married in Vegas. <laughs> and or your prom queen. <laughs> and then we actually have our bride because I think every guy. There's something going on in America that I don't understand anymore. <laughs> yes. See, there you go. This is, this is your fantasy or every guy's fantasy is to have the bride without the gown. So there you go. Isn't she beautiful? I think that's great. I think she looks lovely. All right. And that's uh, my bridal bustier, and she looks lovely wearing it. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave all of you having a little... Really? 
we'll ghost talk around. before you come and join well, us at the party. You know what's going to happen? We're going to talk about you. No. Because we're going to talk don't, about boys. Don't talk about... Yes, we're going to talk behind... I'm Adam. You can talk about boys, but you aren't going to talk about me. <laughs> I think we need to talk about him. What do you think he has on underneath? You think he's got boxer, boxer shorts? <laughs> boxer briefs. You think he's right? Speedo. You think he's got Speedos on? I don't think. He's probably got big hearts or like, you know... Uh, some lycra. You think he's got lycra? I like a flannel, you know, the flannel pattern. You think Robin wears flannel? I don't think so. That's no, just, I don't want to no. think about not it. Not in this Vegas. Context, no. Right? no. Maybe a thong. We'll get him a thong. Okay. Oh, good idea. <laughs> we are so glad that you could party with us, and you are already on the VIP guest list for the next time.